Hello, in today's video we are going to be doing a Hoya unboxing. I think this is my second Hoya unboxing ever on this channel. Um, but it's going to be a Hoya unboxing from... Let me get the name... A purple hyphen Prowler 3 on eBay. And from the looks of the, um, of the listing, I'm not sure why it's in such a big box. I'm hoping, I'm hoping that somehow I got sent a much larger plant than the listing photo, but I'm going to be realistic and assume that there's just a lot of packaging in this box. I mean, honestly, for any Hoya, the, like, length of this package is kind of obscene, but... <laughs> I'm not trying to shade Purple Power 3. Let's get this last piece of tape right here. My shank is gone, and this is like a weird box to open, so... This kind of helps her skelter. Okay, yeah, so there's the plant you can see, and then I'll just kind of rustle it out of here. What is this? Okay, and it's just a nice little, um, nice little thank you note from the person who sent it. If I can get her out of here, be a little manly for a second. <laughs> We have her. I the leaves feel okay. I mean, these, these ones, actually this one feels kind of uh, thirsty, but this one feels fine down here. So I'm gonna throw this box away and then we'll get into it. Okay, so if you didn't see the tag already, this is... Hoya Sweet Scent. So Hoya Sweet Scent is actually a, um, a sort of unknown cross. Um, from Thailand. It's a cross of definitely Hoya Parasitica with either an Obovada, Diversifolia, or a Melaflua. And it's sort of unknown as to which exact um, species contributed to this uh, to this hybrid um, because it was sort of open pollination. It sort of happened randomly. But we do know for sure, I guess, that the uh, pod parent or the mother parent or the receptive parent um, was Parasitica, and then the pollen parent is sort of unknown. She'll go in there. So let's get this tape off, and then we'll discuss the root system. And this isn't going to be like my orchid unboxings, where I sort of take the plant out of its pot and observe the root system that way because if I do that with the Hoya, I'm probably going to disturb the root system and it's not going to be happy with me. Okay, so I already like the uh, medium that's in here. The medium is like a, it's very chunky, lots of organic material, it looks like bark, cocoa choir, perlite, and some sphagnum at least from what I can see. Yeah, so here, uh, this I'm guessing is like cocoa choir, perlite, we have some bark. And I'm just gonna... Oh. Well. I mean, it's holding this. Sorry. Sorry about the focusing, but it's holding this right here. So, um, I'm assuming that it's got a decent root system, because if it didn't have a, a decent root system, it wouldn't be holding on to anything. Um, I would just be pulling a stick out of the ground or out of the pot right here. Um, but yeah, this is my Hoya Sweet Scent. Not much more to say about her. I think she just needs some water or whatever she needs, because maybe it's just because it's a new leaf that it's not as uh, hard as these other ones, because these other ones feel nice, 
Um, but this one is on a new vine right there. It's wrong way. So this one is sort of on a new vine right here. If it'll focus. There we go, right there. Um, so it may just not be fully juiced up yet, um, but it looks fine. This black speckling on the back is no issue for me. I think that's just something that happens with Hoyas. Yeah, and this one's got some of the same sort of leaf speckling. If my freaking camera will focus, which it doesn't want to, okay. So yeah, this has been my Hoya Sweet Scent unboxing from Purple Prowler 3 on eBay. Um, I'll leave the information for the seller, as I always do in the description in case you want to check them out. And um, I apologize for any like focusing or brightness issues in here. I'm trying to go over fully to my um, Canon M50 and we're going to be going through some technical issues as we sort of make the transition. But thank you for sticking through to the end if you did, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.